In Commitment 2024, we're exactly six weeks away from Election Day. And when Iowa voters head to the polls, they can expect to see two constitutional amendments on the ballot this year, one of which concerns the chain of command in Iowa. It states the lieutenant governor would serve as acting governor if something were to happen to the state's top elected official. That includes if the governor resigns, dies, or is permanently disabled. The other amendment on the ballot seeks to lower the voting age to be in line with the U.S. Constitution. Also up for vote in November, whether Iowa Supreme Court Justice David May remains on the bench. May is the only justice up for retention. He was among the majority who upheld the fetal heartbeat bill that Governor Reynolds signed into law in 2023. That law bans abortions once fetal cardiac activity is detected, usually around six weeks. Iowa voters decide whether to retain justices on the state's high court every eight years. May was first appointed by the governor back in 2022 to complete Justice Brent Apple's term when he retired.